Hello everyone, akam jirtu mati hegere online nagenyi badada. Uh, today uh, we will see chapter 6 of grade 12 new curriculum Ethiopia internal development and external influence from 1950 to 1991 worry channel akana Subscribe go chun da gatina. Share, like go chun akka na mota barato the du barat akabu. Thasi sun gehte san akabatan kavajanin isinga farda. Kalla thuman gara topic iti dabar. Topic six point one is about. The restoration of imperial rule and external influences. Under this, we will see Ega Imperial Haile Selassie, Imperial Haile Selassie, Biyeti Gergarsa Motuma Ingilizin, Biyeti Devi Boda, external influences Malfakata Devi U Imperial Haile Selassie Lalajatula. In Unit Three. You studied that the liberation of Ethiopia from the Italian colonial rule involved the British with the, involved the British. Uh, chapter three case at the Akuma Baratanit uh, Ethiopia Bilisuman Ethiopia Kaisa uh, Italian colonialism era Italian occupation era Ega Bilisabati would Gergarsa Motuma. Britain je chul. Britain hir machi se. Immi bilisumma Ethiopia. Britain hir machi se je chul. So with the help of British, the Gersa British Tasiften, Emperor Haile Selassie was restored to his throne in May 1941. Gergarsa Britain Tasiften Haile Selassie gara angoti amsa bara kudasagal afurtamita ka Ethiopia ti debi angoti salun fati je chul. Nevertheless. The British who had entered the country as a liberator. How to you? The Britain Ega Akka Bilisabasat Ethiopia Sente Board in fact replaced the Italians as a copying power. Dugumati Italian Otuma Bakabute. Ango Italian, Ethiopia ke isat tik abdu bakabu te je chun ni dan dama je chun. They assumed the positions of ascendancy in the country in immediate years following the liberation of liberation period. Britain, Ango Gurgudo Italian durang aske isak abat te jurtu, biyati ke isak abat te jurtu. Bilisa ega Ethiopia bahafte boda. Of if unfatijetul. One once the emperors was restored to the throne, altak ero emperor rigara ango tidebe boda ango unfatie boda. He was largely preoccupied with the relation with British. Hariro also Ethiopian in kabamin dura hariro balla. Britain yo jika ba chatu rajetu. Kanatu Britain akai Ethiopia de kertu tasi se. Indeed, there was a considerable tension between Ethiopia and Britain. Hata wati luguman wan nijuru. Soda gudda tu Ethiopia fi Britain jiddu ti umami. The two government. Governments differ differed greatly in their views of Ethiopia's future. Motu malachu, motu mani Ethiopia fi Britainis. Fuldura Ethiopia, feti Ethiopia, fuldura. Chara Ethiopia ka fuldura irrat yani isani gara gara. Gara gara huma gudda kabu. The Ethiopia government. Expected to assume full sovereignty without delay. 
akka mootummaan Itoophiyaa yaadutti yero osoon turin bilisumma guutu sovereignty guutu birmadumma guutu arganna fudanna jaani tiyadan whereas the british whereas the british government considered ethiopia's independence only a long objective hata uti motuma britain falla kana ti mal qaba etop bilisumma etopia yero era boda bilisumma si kanina fi yero era boda ja eniti yaden jechu so at the first at first the first clash a first clash on this question occurred as early as 11 may 1941 akuma etopia bil sabasanin chamsa guya kula tokko dimmi gafin gafin ya da waldabde kana ka e jechul mullati when the emperor appointed his first his first post war cabinet yeronkun yero eti emperor rayle sillasen anga ota cabinet warana boda cabinet sa ka jalqaba biyetti ke setti jare da jechul so after some ups and downs bo abayi tinno boda the british accepted the appointment of the ministers britain mudamu ministero ta kana fudatte regarded them as a merely advisers isan akka akka gorsati gorsu matinno tokko ti ilalen jechu so to the british military administration of the country britain humna waranatin biyetti burcha jirtu kana kanatti akka gorsi totatti ilalen jechu the anglo the anglo ethiopian agreement of 1942 and 1944 when we see the anglo ethiopian agreement of 1942 and 44 in january 1990 1942 the ethiopia and british signed an agreement barakuda sagala furtami lamat ethiopia fi britain wali galte takamalatesan wali galte nisan malatesan kun the terms of the agreement confirmed ethiopia's status as a sovereign state wali galte jalqabatana mali wurra wali galan britain bilisumma ethiopia tana fudatte jechu sovereign state ethiopia as a sovereign state akka biye birmadu ma qabduti fudatte jechu so however almost every articles of the treaty underlined ethiopia's dependency hatawti hatawu male article onni hundinu article onni wali galte tana hundinu ethiopia akka britain irratti hundoitu britain irratti irkatte jirattu as well the dominant role of british gehe biyetin british in dum fatamu ka chalaqi si su de jechu article onni agreementi baraku da sagal afurta mila ma hundinu yechu according to accordingly under the anglo ethiopian agreement of 1942 uh, akkat waligal te uh, bara ku da sagal afurta mila ma kanan the british prime minister in ethiopia british prime minister uh, prime minister ri britain ethiopia ke set would enjoy primacy over all other diplomatic representatives in the country biyati ke set prime minister in english hariro bakabu umma biyati gututti dunfate hogane jechu so the military conventions provided for british assistance in organization of new ethiopian army that was to be trained by british military mission military convention in waligal ten convention in military especially britain 
gargaarsa Britain Ethiopia warana kanni tu gargaarsa warana Britain Ethiopia kanni tu kessatti especially eh warana Ethiopia hara ijarama jiru kanaf so mal de city training de city jettu Britain itu lenjisa kun British military mijini kaisa isa tokko jechul so moreover the british citizens occupied a key post in civil and military advisors rajalat lamilen britain postile sadar ka won ango o gudda kaisau civil fi waranatis isani dum fati jechul they also trained and led the ethiopian police forces britain only ethiopian police force humna policy policy ethiopia kan lenjisu ka hoggenu britain ota turan jechul they also controlled the financial system britain only amas financial system ibiyati dum fatani turan it was agreed that all aspect really are actors relating to the war efforts dimma warana ilalchise wonni irra wali gala yo jirate domestic and international uh, required british approval merkani britain malet ethiopian warana banu sindendes warana lafsu sindendes so dimma biyo ta ke warana ke sati fi dimma warana alatis mal gafa chu kabdi britain if uh, hayama gafa chu tu rajirata jechul so the emperors even had to get permissions from british officials haile silasen matan isa hangota britain irra hayama argachu qaba to declare war against any states motuma to korrati warana banu daf if necessary yo barbachi sate isan irra hayama gafa chutu irrajirata jechul the ogaden the ogaden and a certain strategic areas ogaden ifi nanno strategy tan barbachi sotan tokko tokkos such as the french somali land borders danga french somali land danga kana ilalchi se woldabde ture woldab sanni ilalchi se britain hayya magafa chutu rajirata jechu de addis ababa djibouti railway ammas dimma khara babura etio djibouti railway kan murte sun dan dan jechu da etiopian the hawd hawd as well remained under british administration hawd jechu nanna somale somale present day somaliland kana britain jalatti akka dum fatamu taasise immota kanarratti murte etiopian murte su indanda yo taayes dura gaafachutu hayya magaafachutu rai gama jechuda in short gababu matti by the 1942 anglo etiopian agreement waligalte baraku da sagal afurtamila ba etiopia fi england mallatte sankanan etiopia was firmly under the british economic as well as political control etiopian gutuma gututin jechuni dandama dina gefi siyasan etiopia britainin dum fatamte turte jechuda hence the emperor could not exercise real power ayla selasi moti ayla selasi angu duga exercise ko chundan deenye jechuda so the second anglo ethiopian agreement was signed in december 1944 wali galten inni lamma fa britain fi ethiopia jiddu ti mallate famte wali galte baraku da sagal afurtami afuri tane jechuda second anglo ethiopian agreement te tajannun so uh, this agreement restored some of sovereign rights of ethiopian governments waligal tela isalama fakana mirgoni mirgoni birmaduma etiopia motumo etiopia tif nikanna mejechu ni debisanif so 
they ha that had been denied by the first agreement ka wali galte durarati do watame mirgoni birmaduma biyati motuma etopiatif the dba kanname jechu thus uh, to mention some of some of these rights mirgo ta kanen kaysa uh, the precedence or enjoyed by british ministers in ethiopia over all other diplomatic representatives in the country was lifted dimmi ministera britain ethiopia kaysati dumfatame dimma idil siyasa idil adunya especially diplomacy diplomacy bakabu ummasan ethiopia af debite kanname jechuda the rights to british government in respect to appoint advisers and officials also lifted kaduran britain akuma fetetti advisorota shumu kayu posti takara kayu officialota fila efi fila turansan ethiopia afte bite ethiopian officialota akka merkane fatu filatu tasifa mejechu the british agreed to restore parts of ethio djibouti railway waligal te lamadatana britain karaba bura ethio djibouti railway kana china isa akka ethiopian hoggantu kanitef djechu waligalan the ethiopian army was no longer controlled by british military officials waran ethiopia waran ethiopia so amaboda britainin hindum fatamun hafe djechu so ethiopian waran isi mata isi tif uh oganu uh as well train go to jalkap de jitur by the second anglo ethiopian agreement of 1944 hala kananga uh so the responsibility the responsibility of commanding army warana kan hoggenu etigafatum ma warana hoggenu was given to a newly established ethiopian ministry of war ministera warana hare en ref dabatef etigafatum ma hoggen sawarana ethiopia ministera warana tif kanam tejechu so when we came to the territorial territorial administration issue the issue of ogaden and eritrea in mogadeni fi eritrea ila chise also the british restored the sovereign rights to ethiopia mirga birmaduma biyati ethiopia of the versite kanitus they still remained substantial influences hatawti haga amat or haga yerosanit eh iba hamman jamne qaba chafi gegeisa toran jechu greete rolli they wanted to separate eritrea and ogaden from ethiopia eritrea fi ogaden ethiopia ra adabasu tu adabasu barbadan britain onni in the north kaba gara kabati they were a plan to unite parts of tigray with the highlands of eritrea to form a separate states of tigrayan speakers under british protection kayori sani karori motuma britain kaba biyatiti ummatota afan tigray dubatan including tigrayan speakers tigray region ni ammata na dabalate eritrea wajin motuma of dende efi ka ethiopia ira adabe umu fi britain jalati hoggenam o egmaini sa tasifam motuma of dende ijaru barbadan jechu in the south east gara kibba bahatin the british government proposed the incorporation of ogaden with british somaliland the former italian somaliland to create greater somalia yan gara kibbat britain amas motuman britain mal qabate dufe yadama ogaden fi british somaliland as well as italian somalilandi walik walik qabani greater somalia ijaru somalia guditi ijaru daf karora akana kana proposal akana kana de sanjechu this new creation was to be placed under british trusteeship hala kana dimmi agenda biya hare umu kun dimma enyuf kanne british trusteeship 
council itself kanami hojin sa gege famatu rejechula so the british officials also uh, invest in in research the partition of eritrea hanga on britain chinan to kwamas eritrean aka oko dem tu especially with western lowlands of eritrea was given to given to the then anglo egyptian sudan gara sudan itti akama kaman wari eritrea lowland ke sejiratan sudan itti akama kanif makaman ya de qabti jechul hence the plan came a source of fear karori kun karori sanka kun matta soda suspicion shaki mistrust wal amanu dabu fi even anger on the part of ethiopia ethiopia ke sat iruma ara madda ara tani turanjechu so ethiopia become the founding members of united nation in 1945 ethiopia misensa united nation hun deisa ke sajirti jechu baraku da sagala for permission it league of nation is akasum immediately made a strong demand on both ogaden and eritrea imo ogaden fi eritrea qacellotti jela sararte yero masanetti gafatte jechu united nation historically sena dan yolalle ogaden had been integral part of ethiopian empire before the italian invasions also italian ethiopia were in dura nanno ogaden Ethiopia part of Ethiopian territory da jechu danga Ethiopia ke sejerti so Ethiopia brought the matter to London conference of 1945 dimicha Ethiopia baraku da segal for permission itti legal te walgayi London of allied power allied power in kataise baraku da segal for permission itti dimma kana chira kafte jechu but the conference didn't respond to ethiopia's claim dim ethiopia kana gafi ethiopian de hcte kana wan ethiopian de hcte kana also de bisan kan ni hafe jechu nevertheless after the long period of diplomatic struggle capso diplomacy yero air to boda the british withdrew from parts of ogaden in 1948 baraku da sagala for tamis addetit britain walaka ogaden gadifte baati jechu on the other hand the hood now no only hood present day somaliland uh, uh, what uh, the british called reserve area reserve area jete uh, kayam to hood fi dangan da balata bra remained under british administration until 1944 uh, hanga bar kuda sagal shantami afuriti british domination ni british control ijala turte jechuda finally the, the that same year barmol fakatati british restored the entire ogaden regions to ethiopia baraku da sagal shantami afuriti ogaden gutu gututti ethiopia ke ever chiefte ke sabati jechula britain so after the italian surrenders italian ege ethiopia gadifte bate bod eritrea remained under the british military administration from 1941 to 51 baraku da sagal afutami takka hanga shantami takati eritrean britanin warana britanin bula turte jechu ethiopia waged a long diplomatic struggle to regain eritrea ethiopia gama ishitin qabso diplomacy yero era eritrea argachuf qabso diplomacy yero era gegesa turte ethiopia had a strong cases on the ground of history uh, ethiopia sena chima kesaw imela eritrea ilal chise ground base chima qabu qabti jechula especially sena ilal chise eritrea part of ethiopia de jechu national defense dimawarana biyeti ilal chise dimawarana biyeti ilal chise eritrea base de jechula gafi saden kana ragam access to the sea outleti khara galanati qawa hula galana argachu wa saden kana of kesa qabdi jechu dimmi eritrea etiopia daf wa saden kana jechu historically sena da yolale the entire part of eritrea 
or simply the Maramillash had been an integral part of Ethiopian Empire before the Italian establishment themselves over the area in 1890s. Hanga Barakura said the Sagal Tamota also Alianuni Nano Chankabatin Dura Nano Ni Maramillash or present day Eritrea Danga Ethiopia to Rejectur. Regarding the national defenses, Warana Bialesa. Were on a defensive Yalesa Ilachese, Ethiopia cited evidences. Ragan Ethiopian Abdumali that Eritrea served as a base both in, in 1895 and in 1935 when Italy invaded the country. Uh, Eritrean Bezila, Lola Adua Tifi, Lola Adua, Barakuda Sagal, Lola. Uh, Italian, Ethiopia, Ratibante, Barakula Sagal, Ola Sadis, Galta Mission ETV, so do Mission ETV is busy to take it to Eritrea. So when the, 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 the restoration of Eritrea is to be uh, to also believed to have answered Ethiopia's quest for the access to the sea. Gafin Kunamas, Dimmi Eritrea, Ethiopia, Ojin, Ethiopia, Ami Ethiopia, Tau, Gafi, Ethiopia, uh, Hula Galana, Kandi Bisulajitu. Under the British administration, Gafa Britain, Jalat Tibula Turte, various competing local groups, Garen, Hedun, Walturgumatur and Eritrea Keset, especially Uma Manjatul, such as the Unionist Party, Party Uniani, Muslim League, Muslim League Kajamufi, Liberal Progressive Party, Party. Bilisa uh, Bilisuma, uh, as well pro Italian groups consisting of Italian uh, settlers and ex, -ex Ascaris and peoples of mixed race. Party pro Italian group, party Mahal, weren't Italian, catch it, case at Tiafan, can if case Agabatu, Ascarot, Ascarot, Warana, Italian Kadurani, Tifi, Umata, Shani Wali Maha. The demand of these local groups, Garen Kun, Garen Party, political party Kun, Yadam Adada, Kaban, Yadam Nisani Kun, Walumagala, broadly divided into two. The Bakalamatik on Nelalunid and Dinage too. These were the union uh, with Ethiopia. Garen Tak, Ethiopia, Ojin Eritrea, Ethiopia, Ojin United Tok Abdija. The other independence for Eritrea. Eritrea, Bilisumaran. The demand of the union was organized by a unionist party. Yan Yadamni Ethiopia Jigamta Umu Tokuma Umu Kun Party Unionist Kanan Kan Ijara Medaju. So which was also largest and political group in Eritrea. Kun Misensa Digersa Bala Digersa Seasa Bala Eritrea Kesak Abajatu. And Ama Hawasa. So the demand for the independence was organized. Bilisuma Wari Bilisuma Eritrea Gafa to Amo organized by the collection of different groups. Gare Maha Abdadda of Kesak Abdu Khanan Kan Ijarame, including the Muslim League. Muslim League Ifi, Liberal Progressive Party, as well as Pro Italian Group. Party in Sadene Afte, Yadama it Eritrean Independence Je U Kabkan Kabani Dayatu which wanted to ensure the continuation of Italian domination. Akka Italian, it dominate gote, control gote, umfate, it bulchitu, barbaden jetul. The issue of Eritrea went through several stages before being resolved. Osora Konkun, in Furamindura, Dimmi Eritrea, Adimsa, Stegi, Heddu, Kandabarse, jetul. Especially, the first four power, first a four powers commission. Commission was established by the allies of the Second World War: Britain, France, Soviet Union, and United States of America to resolve the Eritrean question. Gafi Eritrea kana Davis Olaf, he Olaf, beyond Afran superpower. Jaman kun kamagasani asit the commissioni to kudaban. Commission eleven, especially, uh, nevertheless, unable to resolve the Eritrean question. Lima Eritrea for whom then the individual. The four powers, whom uh, known Afrankun, re referred the matter to the United 
nation in 1948 bara united nation it fudatan fudan jechu so the united nation uh, appointed a new commission commission united nation in commission hare dimma eritrea ratti dabe this commission consisting of burma guatemala norway pakistan and south africa biyota misensa uh, united nation tan burma guatemala fi norway pakistan uh, south africa kan of fake satti maka uh, makate gare jila kan the commission kana jaran jechu commission kun the task of commission was to find out the wishes of eritrea people task in sani mali hoji nisani fedi ummato te eritrea lalu fi jechu fedi ummato te eritrea lalu fi kayo sa kada batef the united commission arrived in eritrea in february 1950 baraku da sagal shantamitti commission ni kun eritrea dakabe Nevertheless, the commission was divided and could not reach in uh, an animous decision. Ega Eritrea do fego da commission in biota kanine raoli do fego, biota shana ne raoli do fego, waligal te walfakatara gahu indendeni jechul. Guatemala and Pakistan recommended granting independence to Eritrea. Guatemala fi Pakistan bilisuma Eritrea. Uh, South Africa and Burma recommended federation with Ethiopia. South Africa and Burma had uh, uh, the Ethiopia federation of Ethiopia. Norway recommended Eritrea's union with Ethiopia. Norway had the Ethiopia. Eritrean Ethiopia was union to Abdi, Yada Majau, Kandi Hisan Yetu. Of these three various recommendations, recommendation Takao Yada Garagara Yate Kanakesa, the United General Assembly voted for federation. United Nations General Assembly, Mal Filate, Federation of Eritrea with Ethiopia. Hala Kanan, Eritrea was federated. With Ethiopia on December 2, 1950, and the federation was put into effect in 1952. Barakura Sagal, Shantamilamat, Hojiti Kamejitul. After that, that the, the, the period in Ethiopia is referred to as the American era. Following the departure of Britain, Ega Britain, Ethiopia Kesa. The United States Economic Commissions uh, Commissioning Dinage America Ethiopia Thereby laying the ground for an alliance Haldure Waligalte Waltahinsa Lafakayan It should be noted that when we were the initiative for closer relationship between Ethiopia and America came from the former. Adem si hariron hariron Ethiopia fi America jidduti egalame kun fedi Ethiopia raka kaeju fedi Ethiopia raka madde because the emperor who was distressed by British domination during the first decades of the post-war liberation period. Haila selasin, Britain in aman tamu aman umma ek Britain in rata bebo da, warana bebo da, especially wago tam kutra korunan, warana bilisuma Ethiopia bebo da. He sought the American as a counterweight. Falla Britain in America wajin hari rogo dun, mali Britain abdi kuta chisu da itu. So. America wajin hariro egale as a counterbalance. Osuma Britain wajijirut hariro America wajin egalunsa Britain abdi kuta chisufi. After the after Eritrea federated with Ethiopia, ega Eritrea and Ethiopia wajin federation ni umtebod. The United States and Ethiopia concluded an agreement that gave the United States a 25 years lease on the Kenyu communication station in Asmara. On May 22, 
ega ito Eritrean Ethiopia Wage Federation yung umte boda Ethiopia fi American waligal te lafa yokau lazy kanyu communication stationi lafa humni waran America kesa kubatu amata didde missionif lazy dan Ethiopia America afkan nite am sadi demilam bara kuda sagal shantami sadi tijaju so after that time at that time the kanyu was one of the largest radio relay and communication monitoring station in the world achira khase yerosan rakase kanyu lafti communication ikun kanyu station ikun aduna ratti imma communication fi radio relay bakka irato hatamu da fi isa sadarka adunat isa gudda de jitu it was of paramount importance to the american to monitor soviet radio communication ammas basasuma khaisau radio communication russia Bucuraf, hoganuf, berbaca semua sa, all ana ada jual. Kanyo station ini for United States of America. The radio station was named as Kanyo. Bagitun radio station ini pun mal jami Kanyo jami. To commemorate the first Ethiopian battalions, which fought the Korean War, as part of United Nations forces on the side of America. Kun kanyu kun maka warana Ethiopia, Korea, Deme, Korea, United Nations jalati gama Amerika ti waranu Korea Deme ya de chulaf maka amuk ke e de chula maka ang kanyu station jau kun in in turn in return for it is use of kanyu kanyu maka kana fayedamu gama biratin Amerika. America pledged to provide five million dollars to equip and train Ethiopian armed forces. American dollar million shan Ethiopia daf mecha warana Ethiopia mecha kan mecha dan as well as training gid training gid daf Ethiopia humna warana Ethiopia tif kan nite jechul wada galte so. The USA also made further commitment to military assistances. Hala karan chalmati America namas waran Ethiopia chim sudaf wa adar galte jechula in the subsequent barota ti anang kaisa. By the 1970s barakura sa torbata mo ta kaisa Ethiopia came to absorb some 60% of total American military aids to African continent. Barakura sa torbata mo ta boda. Kaisa, degar sewarana Amerikan Afrika Afrika ni tu kaisa persenti jahatam itu pe Afrika jatuh je cula. Therefore, the air forces, navy, ground forces were equipped with American weapons. Acibod, humni ke lesa itu pe navy, as well as ground, waran telefonis, mesha warana Amerika ufataniti. Where Jiru Jechul. So by 1974, Barakura Sagal Torbata Miyafurit, Ethiopia's armed forces had become totally dependent on United States for military, hardware, and spare parts. Barakura Sagal Torbata Miyafurboda, Warani, Ethiopia, Gutu Magutu Ti, Degarsa, Warana, United States. Kan itu firat Honda aja tu. Mesan, acer radufa, spare parti ni Amerika radufa aja tu. The Americans were also involved in improving, extending communications and education. Amerika non ni, inuma, unnam ti, unnam tv, dimota, unnam tv. Bernota, Babeli Sufi, 
foyeyin sabarno taati fi as well as communication ni irra qacellotti khaysa senani sektari kan qacellotti baballi senjechulo the americans assisted the establishment of ethiopian airlines in 1945 humni qillensa ethiopia yokaw ethiopian airline akka dabatuf degersa cima taasifte jechulo american degersa america tin kan dabate le jechulo so the americans also assisted in the improvement of improvement of surface uh, transport uh, ya bi la fa kana uh, transportation ikan degers gudda uh, tasifte fo ye inserti yechu fo ye inserti american degers gudda tasifte the imperial highway authority the imperial highway authority kheisaw uh, karan uh, ministry transport yechu ka amma ka amma kun highway authority kun akada abatuf is came into existence in 1951 51 barako da sagar shantami takati yoro da abatu degersa gudda tasifte yechu american with the task of maintaining as well as developing country's road network haran gudan akka biyeti ke satti networkin kara akka ijaramuf get degersa gudda tasisa turan so authority was directed by americans uh hogantoni hogunuman highway authority kun american kan kanna mu ture yo taw until it is got it got it is first ethiopian manager hanga manager jalqaba ka ethiopia bara ku dosa gal jata mi lama ti argetutti america to gona ture jechula imperial highway authority so the imperial board of telecommunication telecommunication board of telecommunication imperial Uh, which was set up in 1952 baraku da sagar shantami lama tero abatu got substantial help from america tekir sachima america ra argate jechu the americans also had considerable influence in shaping the country's education system sirna bernota biyetti ajel chu kesatti american gahe gudda abacha turte jechu the ethiopian education system mo was modeled after the american system of education enuma barnoni modela america ratti dabate yechu america hordo fudan etopia ke satti baballa chu egale yechu the system continued up to 1974 etopia revolution sirni barnota kun hanga bar ku dasagal torbata mi afuri warraksa etopia hanga kauti ittifufe yechu The America became the main destinations for young Ethiopians who sought higher education. America namas destiny der gagota Ethiopia barnota fagod af barbadanif American maltate gaum sasani tate jechu. Achi baratan jechu. America played a tremendous role in the administration of Haile Selassie universities now Addis Ababa University. America no namas gahe gudda tabacha turan bulchinsa haile selassie university presidentin isan ture jechu gahe gudda tabatan peace for corpus program of 1960 bara gudda sagal jahata mota fes peace corpus program greatly contributed to the education system of ethiopian secondary school manne barno ta sadar kala ma fa ethiopia tif gahe gudda tabate jechu da peace corpus program american khanan barno ta etiopia program khanan de garatur te jechu so to conclude to conclude the period following the departure of britain up to 1974 ethiopia revolution may to be described as american era baroni ega britain etiopia gadifte baate hanga bara ku dasagal torbata mi afur warraks etiopia tit yeron kun etiopia ke sati mani bekama american ira jame ti bekama jechu it should be noted that this american ascendancy uh, in every aspect of ethiopia life was disliked by many ethiopians uh, eka american uh, britain bakabute etiopia ke sati dimota heddu dimota jiru jirenya etiopia no ta hunda especially ethiopia no ni uh, america in jalan imma american akanati britain bakabute etiopia ke sawahun de control gochukan 
Ethiopia nonni hinjalan ni jechu in particular students view this situation the situation as being with the global framework of american imperialism inuma baratoni dimma america kana america and ethiopia to dominate gochu kana akka imperialism america america ti ilalan jechu the anti american Americanism in Ethiopia was particularly strong in the late 1960s and the early 1970s. Inuma worry jibba America kaban. Ethiopia noni jibba America kaban. Abso jaba worrein tahasisan in barota ora sagal jahata mo ta kaisa abso on sani baiye chimto torte jechula. When we come to the socio economic, the socio economic conditions. Social organization. The motto: "Hawasuma di nge fi ijarsa hawasa yolale." There we got agriculture, land tenure, and the issue of land reforms. Imma ona hala lafti tikok odamin salafa bulchin salafa the issue of land reform. Reformi lafarati taya sifami kana bali na kani lalu taha jitu. Accounting is for over sixty percent of gross domestic or GDP. Onniti di nge bi yeti percenti jahatam kang abatu di nge re jitu. Eighty percent of the labor's forces hum ni namatis percenti sa detam. Agriculture remained the country's most important sector in the post-liberation period. Barota bilisumma boda onniti backbone of the country's economy. Lafe dugdati jetu dinagge itopiatif lafe dugdati. Coffee and other agricultural commodities. Bunafi omistonik onna. Kanin bra, kanin bra, comprise more than ninety percent of Ethiopia's export. One total Ethiopian gara biya alati ergitu, ergi erga biya ala percenti segaltam kan of kesi tika batu rejeju. Ethiopia the 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 has a great agricultural potential. Ethiopia namas, humna otisa kudagati. Because of its vast area of fertile, lafa lafa on nafto, lafa fertile ite, lafa balla kabdi, diverse climate, elinsa dada kan efek es adequate rainfall, roba gaha kabu, large labor pools, hum namas otisa balla kabu jechu. Nevertheless, despite its potential, hum nakan potential akanan alati the country's agriculture has remained. Underdeveloped. Hatta uti onni Ethiopia for ye ina osong bersisin hafe. Several factors accounted can be mentioned for the little advances of Ethiopia's agriculture. Onna dubati hafinsa onna Ethiopia kanaf sababoni hedun nila kaa mojetu. Niipsam. Because of drought. Sababa hongi which has persistently affected the countries to this day. Haga ammat. Waltifu fiisal biyati miira ka juro honge poor economic basis dinag dinagge low productivity omistuma tika weak infrastructure halli iti omishan wanti omishaf barbaachisu. Infrastructure in that level, low level of technology, technology in the in the garamu yetu on Ethiopia. Government policies, policy motu mamba su onarati. Government is neglect of agricultural onna dagate onna dagate jerti yetu onna de garu yetu. Government policy. Ethiopia's agricultural sector has performed poorly. Kanatu onni Ethiopia akka performansi 
bu'a tiqqa gal mesu tasise jechur when we until the 1974 revolutions hanga warak sabara kuda sagal torbata mi afuriti the ethiopia had a complex land tenor system ethiopia sirna lafa yo kaw tenor systemi land holdingi eh waltata te ke qaba qaba chaturte so there were different kinds of land tenor system in the country uh, akatan bulchin salafa lafti it qoqodemtu gara gara tu etiopia ke sajira jechuda however the land tenor system can be understood in a rudimentary ways if one examine it in the context of the basic distinction between land ownership pattern in the north and that of in the south hatawti halli lafa itibulchin sirni bulchin salafa etiopia keset bifa adate hubatamu ni dandamechu yo namni tokko especially garagaruma akata abba qabenya kaaba fi kibba jiddu jirtu garagaruma guddatu jira jechu land tenor system in kibba ke sejiru fi kaaba ke sejiru wal adda wal falle sejechu qada jechu historically ethiopia was divided into north highland ethiopia bakka malitte adde ko north highland didan kaaba lafa ol ka kaaba as well which consisted of the core of the old christian kingdom motuma christian kingdom ka dur ka if ke sette amate and the southern highlands inni lama fan uh, highland la fa ol ka o uh, kibba ke sejiru most of which brought under the imperial territorial expansion ke saw warren uh, humna babalifanna uh, motuma merlikin uh, ethiopia jalatti kufan uh, kanen if ke sette qabata jechu kanafu land tenerin kaaba fi kibba wal adde jechu the north south dichotomy garagaruma kaaba fi kibba jiddu jirkun was reflected in land tenor system land tenor system ikanan ni ibsa majechu further uh, in northern provinces kaaba biyatti motumo ta kaaba biya ke sajiran particularly gojam bagemidir uh, tigray wollo northern shawa motumo ta kanen ke sette the major forms of ownership a bank a benyuma inuma type of communal system lafti which was known as rist risti dan oda majechu rist jechu communal system community de jechu lafti tan hawasa hawasa ti jechu most peasants in the northern highlands onnambultoni nano kaaba ke sejiratan held at least some rist lands lafa mata sani qabu jechu abba qabinyu ma lafa san qabu jechu risti qabu but there were some members of minority ethnic group shanyin tikkon lakof sisani tikka lafa male jiratan akuma jirani te jechu the other major forms of tenor was gelt laf qoqodemi salafa akatan bulchin salafa inibra gelt system id hadra risti jen gelt id akaritan so it was the right to acquire from monarchy or from provincial rulers who were empowered to make land grant in nibra akata lafa itergatan abban qabenyu ma lafa mirga kana motumma kana motumma kana motumo tananno ti fi monarchy sani central government irra kana majechu kumalif kana ma empowered to make land grant mirga lafa kana khiru qabu jechu land lafa kan argachu haqabu fi hiru haqabu tu jire jechu kan e sir argatan motuma jiddu golati fi motuma nan no tir argatan galt owners baala galt kajewun collected tributes gibira onnam bultu pizan tri ragur exacted obtained labor harabiratin tajajila humna humna onnam bultu takana a uh, bi fa payment itin eh uh, in kind for the from the peasants achira argate jet onna butoni bilisa tajajilan humna sani tin jet until the government instituted salaries hanga motuma mindan kanini fitti in the 20th century hanga jara di demafat gelt rights were milgi mirgi abba gelti jet 
ምርጊ ገልቱም አኩን where a typical form of the compensation for the officials for an officials inuma bakamindat bakaminda selakhen namufsen galt righti qaban galt righti the right to collect tributes from peasant in kind in cash malaqafi bifa bifan irraguru daf mirga kana qanam mirga lafa kana hirutis kaqabu isani jechu so other form of tenor included tenor ikana kesa kanen if kesa tiamatu kesa kun samun samun maret mangist maret madaria land or samun land mangist land as well madaria land jani lafa adan qodani jiran jechu tenor system ikana kesa ti samun maret kajenun kun Uh, it was a land which was given uh, which the government granted for the Ethiopian Orthodox Church kun lafa church if kanam samo maret yenan jechu samo maret yenan state owned large uh, tracts of land known as mangist in madaria motu malamas lafa balla qaba lafa mangist madaria kajani jechu so mangist was a land registered under government property abba qabenyu ma motu man kan gal me fame lafatu jire jechu lafatu jire lafti kun mal janam lafa mangist maret yani jechu mangist maret so mother ya was a land granted mainly for government official anga ota motu matif ka kanamu mother ya kanamaf mother ya kanamaf kaisau veteran war warre warana injifan no galan warana warana mohatani galanif mother ya kanam other patriots ወረን ጃላለ ቢያ ቀበን ኢሳን ካና ማደሪያ ካና ካናኒፍ ኢን ዘ ፎርም ኦፍ ፔንሽን ኤንድ ሰለሪ ቢፋ እቲ ጦራ ታፊ ዮካው ሰለሪቲ ቢፋ ሚን ዳቲን ኢሳንፍ ካና ማጀቹ ዲስ ፊውዳል ላንድ ቴነር ስርኒ ፊውዳላ ላንድ ሲስተም ይኩን ስፔሻሊ Uh, play a negative role in economic life of the peasantry in uh, post liberation uh, period warana yo how bilis yero bilisuma etopia boda sirni akatan abba qabenyuma fiudala abba qabenyuma lafa fiudala kun jiru dinake jirenya affect ka gode jechu qacheloti especially on nambulto ta affect go dejer particularly in this period barakanatti yero kanatti there was a, an acceleration of the process of privatization of land abba qabenyu ma du fa go dechu privatization of land dito rejechu adem sakana ke set the landless tenants on nambulto ni la famale hafan they were few in northern provinces kaba ke set la kofsan tikka tanis where the rest system were able to resist uh, the pervasive pervasive influence of privatization iba kudda rest system irra gefi of ra they able to resist uh, privatization privatization ikan abba abenu ma dum fa la fa dum fa de fachu kan kan mor me da jechu kan mor me da so abenyu ma qof oson tayin jiru jirenya qonnan bultotuma kan iba irregesi sede jitu however in the southern provinces ato male kibba kesat nano nano le kibba kesat because of the own growing process of privatization enuma abba qabenyu ma dum fa kana ba inan dabala akuma du fen abba qabenyu ma dum fa dabala la fa dabala akuma du fen few farmers owned the lands which they worked they worked qonnan bultonni mubasni la fa duran qota ta turan ofif dum fa tan jechu argatan in the southern provinces southern land ownership pattern 
kibake sa akatan qabeenyuma lafa developed as a result of land measurements and land grant lafa hiru lafa lafa safaru safari lafa du fi jechu safari lafa kanatu especially kibake satti dagagi following the incorporations of the regions into ethiopian empire ega nanoni kunnen ga empire ethiopia ti dabala mamboda in the late 19th century uma jarra ku sagla fati jechu the gabbar system sirna gabbar system ikanatu dufe which in the northern settlers uh, which northern settlers were given tributary rights over southern peasants kun hala itin mirga onnambultoni kaba onnambultota kibba irratti argatanida enabled the settlers warren buqato ta kaba kan o buqato ta onnambultota kaba radu fanif to take over much of the land of the south kibba ke sala faguutu ma gututti dominate godani fudatan jechu eh warra kibba ra suru parchas kan rabite from the impoverished gabbars warren gabbaro ta dadaban ra gabbarota gibira gabbaru dadaban ra even qotachu dadaban ra suru forcible sizer humnan toatan jechu humnan ra fudatan this to a large extent the southern peasants qonnambultoni kibba were reduced to tenant qonnambulto ta lafa male tani hafan who paid rents inuma lafasan malka kira kafalan kira dan irra fudatani qotan for the use of lands which had been their own lafu maduran tasani tutesan irra kire fatcha turan jechu to make the matter worse one kana wanni hamme isu peasants had no security of tenor qonnambultoni mirga bilisuma abba qabeenyuma garantin qaban jechu garantin qaban because of land owners that had the right to evict peasant qonnambultota inuma irra ka ufis lafasan irra ariyamu jerri kun irra ariyu mirga qabu lafu masani irra ariyu at any time they were yero barbadani irra ariyu dandaw in the post liberation period where yero bilisuma kana border ka jiddu fe the side by side uh, with the privatization process abba qabeenyuma dunfa lafa ademsi abba qabeenyuma lafa kun central government issued a series of land tax decree lafa lafa rat lafsi gibira lafa raguru baase jechu motu manji tukala the first degree degree injal qabatun on land taxes gibira lafa ilal ci se that fixed the rate of the land taxes lafatan adan qodeti gibira murtawa irra darbe on the classification of rural land lafa badiya according to it the provinces amma lafa badiya akka akata o mistu mai sitin as cultivated land lam janin lafa albuda qabdu lafa qonnaftaatu sami cultivated land lamtaf baddadare kajanin kajidugala omistu ma sajidugala fi an cultivated land taf lafan qotamne jani bakka sajitti barqura sagal afurtami lamatti lafa etiopia bakka sajitti adda qodan jechu it should be noted that the gasha lafti kun gasha safaramti which is 40 hectare hectare afurtam was used as the rate of land measurement gasha tokko gasha lama jani safaru kanara reeti kanan egalen jechu the decree on land tax raised the tax on measured land lafa lafa safara me kanarat eh gibir lafa ol kaada from time to time yero gare roti a new tax laws seri gibira faced stiff resistance konnambul to tabira finchila hamatu isa konname from rest holding regions of northern ethiopia warren kaba resti qaban resti tenya ranga baru finchila itikasan jechu during the period or imperial period yero imperial period ikesa development of development of agricultural sector was retarded qonni ethiopia 
budget ya far itu agriculture received less than 2% of budget allocation budget etiopia percent ila moqofatu qonnaf ramada majechu ummani biyetti ammo population depend on it ummani um biyetti irabuttan qonna kana ratti hunda as a result agriculture agriculture continued to grow below the population growth rates of the country qonniti baina la kofsa etiopia tin credit kutta chatore jechu according to the world bank akka world bank in ipsetti agricultural production increased at the average of annual rate of 2.1% between 1965 and 1973 barakuda sagal jata mission yanga torbata misadit qonni etiopia gudina tikka percent lama tuqa takka gal me sejechu while population increasing at an average of annual 2.6 percentage hata u bayi ni umata etiopia mo percent lama tuqa jan dabala kaddu fejju yero wal fakkatati later the imperial government began to give attention to agricultural sector hata u ti motumman imperiali garabodati qonnaf attention ti yefana gudda kenna ture jechu commercial agriculture expanded qonni ammaya babalati with foreign concessions and government involvement warri biyalati fi biyya keesatis motumman qonna kana ratti hirmaachu hirmaachu dan qonniti commercial qonniti ammaya etiopia keesatti eegalti jechu especially the tandao cotton tandao afar keesatti cotton ni ko omishu plantation and seti tumara umara keesatti cotton a good example of expansion of commercial farming qonna ammaya babalina qonna ammaya fakkenya gari ajechuda tandao cotton plantation if seti tumara so the government policy permitting investors to import fertilizers pesticide tractors combiners until 1973 amma motumman investor of aka etti taao fertilizer pesticide farra harama tractor afi combiner biye ke biye galchu hayya mejechu kun hanga bara kuda sagal torbata misadit fuel free of import duties karat alla bili sagode encourage the rapid expansion of larger commercial qonna balda gakisa fi babalisa akature safi sam babalisa akature da yechu so hala kanan also the issue of land reform reforming lafa mo was not addressed until 94 revolution until 1974 revolution hanga warak sabara kudo sagal torbata mi afuriti dimma informing te yechu dimmi le reform ilafa the imperial government made no successful attempts to improve the conditions of jirujire ne qonna bultota fo yesu fu motuman ila silase attempti hingone jechoni danda ma jechu so in 1971 bara kudo sagal torbata mi takatti the ministry of agriculture introduced minimum package program mpp bara kudo sagal torbata mi tak minister riqonna package package minimum package program jaw kana sponsored by swedish international development agency sida dan sponsor tawdan aimed at bringing about economic and social changes jijirama dina ge fi hawasuma fi dudaf kaye fate egala me jechu etiopia kaysetti the pmpp included credits for the purchase of inputs such as fertilizer inuma dabbani kun project in kun program kanan likin tao bitachu improve seeds shanyi filatama for yesu pesticide farrarama innovatives especially innovation irratti malaka liki kenna ture jechu so uh, the establishment of the cooperatives will dialed cooperative 
ማበተን the provisions of infrastructure uh, especially qonnaf halli mejaw karan etibahu kon kanne 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 fk setti amat mainly water supply bishadi hisa bishani all weather roads kara hala qillesa hunda dandamatu ijarudan the program designed for rural development da gagina qonna bultota kaysa u badiyatif kan designed it was the first introduced through the project called chilalo agricultural development kadu kanan biyetti kaysat ijarame jechuda chilalon projecti wontota qonna foyeyna qonnatif hojjetu gudda qoranna qonna ratti gaggesu isa gudda da jechuda biyetti kaysat this program later program ni kun umarra uh this program facilitated uh, the establishment of similar international financed projects in adaa and walaita area nano adaa tifi walaita tit program ni walfakatan akka Ethiopia ke sathi ijaramu thasi fa meje chula. Chiefly because of the pressures from external sponsor, inuma degar sabud daraf aisar tiunda alar ti hunda unisani alar ti hunda unisani degar saf alar ti sponsor alar ti hunda unisani the imperial began to consider land reforms in the early. Imperary, akka reformi lafa barakura sagal jahata mota kei sagal gesusu taasi seje chula. In 1961, the Committee on Land Reform, barakura sagal jahata mita kati, Committee on Reformi lafa ijahara meje chula, which developed into land reform. Reformi lafa ti, ka ol gudda te Committee on kun, and the developed authority in Sadarka, Authority itu baru kita segera jahat misian ul budda te zen tu ministry land reform minister saderka ministerat bulcin saf ministerat ka ul ministera reformi lafat ka ul budda te baru kita segera jahat misian ti hangus takat reformi lafah kerjaisa thore tu sama ekstent nevertheless no meaningful land reformi was made hatta uti one reformi lafah kabatamaan tok oso Hujit ini kami hafal je tu. Tenasi bill was first presented to the parliament in 1964. Billin especially orang butuh tala family. Billin toko parlama baru kuda segel jahat mi afud dia hati. However, the parliament could not introduce reform. Parlaman garu reformi kana gagisun dendingnya since it represented the interest of the landro. Because when ni garu hujit ini billin kuni ni kami nif feri aboti lafa kan calak isisu jamet je tu. So the suffering of peasantry orang butuh ni meet dan orang butuh ta from road. Hong Kong, locust invasions, where are one is a farming forced money built in mass, money sectors of the Ethiopian society. Am Hawasa Ethiopia had do in to favor land reforms in the mid 1960s. Wala kajara barakura sagal jahat mota kes reformi akatasi famu malgore barbachi seje chul. In 1965. Since 1965, university students, Baraton University, Barakura Sagal Jata Mishaniti, who were known as, known for their famous slogan, Land to the Tiller. A slogan, I don't know, Lafti Takon Nambul Totati, led a land reform movement. Land reform movement in Akka, Ufutasi Seja Chuda. Absom Baratota University, Barakura Sagal Jata Mishan, Kagisanja Chuda. During the 1972 and 74, drought and famine, uh, the imperial government did not work hard to assist the rural Ethiopians and try to cover up the crisis. 
inuma bara kura sagal jata torbata mila mahanga torbata mi afruit belli fi belli haman as well as gogin si haman hongen haman motuman irratin hojjatin ture inuma yu motuman uisu af yale jechu as a result hundred thousands of ethiopians were lost their life kuma dibata mota alla kaman umman ethiopia lubbu dabe lamilen ethiopia kuma dibota alla kaman lubbu daban sabbe la kana by the 1974 it was clear that the archaic archaic land tenure system was one of the major factors responsible for the background conditions of ethiopian agriculture and the onset of the revolution when i fatu bara kura sagal torbata mi afuriti le lafti abkatan abanka benu malafuma etiopia khaisati khaisau worri lafa kana dum fate ture on etiopia akaduba tafufi especially jijiramni akka qonna etiopia rangirefi revolution in akadufuf sababate jechu revolution in akadufuf sababate next we will see modernization trade and industry until this thank you for your attention